Bentornati in Italian Lessons with Flavia. Be sure and subscribe and if you like this video, give a thumbs up. In Italian, just like any other language, there is more than one way to say the same thing. Today we are going to focus on expressions that indicate the occurrence of events. First, let's take a look at three verbs that mean to happen. Accadere, capitare, succedere. Accadere means to happen, occur or take place and is mostly used in older books. It is more formal and least used in everyday conversation. Here's an example. Listen and repeat. Potrebbe accaderci qualcosa di brutto se non seguiamo le regole. Something bad could happen to us if we don't follow the rules. Capitare means to happen casually and is used in everyday speech. Here's an example. Chissà perché capitano tutte a me. I wonder why everything happens to me. Succedere is by far the most common of all verbs meaning to happen. Here's an example. A volte può succedere anche a noi. Sometimes it can happen to us. Next, there is the phrase può darsi, which translates to it may be, it may happen. It is followed by the che clause with the verb in the subjunctive. Here's an example. Può darsi che non cambi niente. It may be that nothing has changed. Now let's see three verbs that you can use talking about an event taking place and translate to take place. Aver luogo. Il corso avrà luogo nel pomeriggio. The course will take place in the afternoon. Svolgersi. La manifestazione si è svolta nella calma. The demonstration took place without incident. Tenersi. La riunione si terrà a New York. The meeting will take place in New York. The verb fare is often used speaking about films and programs in the third person plural. For example, cosa fanno in tv stasera? What's on TV tonight? Cosa fanno al cinema stasera? What's on at the cinema tonight? We use the verb ricorrere when an event recurs regularly. For example, la festa di Natale ricorre il 25 dicembre. Christmas is on December 25th every year. Verificarsi is used to talk about one single occurrence or regular event. For example, l'esplosione si è verificata subito dopo la mezzanotte. The explosion happened just after midnight. Thanks for watching, I hope you liked this video and don't forget to follow me on Facebook and Instagram at Italia Lessons with Flavia. So ciao for now!